Hey everyone, welcome back to the channel. My name is Danny Chess and welcome back to One Year 365. Today is May 20th. Uh, no, today is May 18th actually. And today is episode 353 out of 365. Yes, we're almost there. We're barely over there. Uh, we only have 12 days left, I think. Uh, uh, is it 12 days left? Yeah, it is 12 days left until the entire uh, series is over uh, 12 days left that is barely two weeks from now um, literally 12 days from now will be the final episode of one year 365 and after that i'm not gonna continue this series because this series has been over so yeah but i guess that'll be it uh for today we will actually talk about the last uh celebration day uh, this is International Museum Day, which happened uh, today, actually, on May 18th. Um, this happened... Uh, I think this this was... Uh, I think this is supposed to be celebrated or commemorated throughout the world, I guess. And yeah, um, this is the final one because obviously... Uh, next week, though, for the last 12 days... I'm not gonna, um, I already, you know, like, I already prepare for what I'm going to do, in fact, in the last 10 days, actually, um, it will just be about, you know, like, the final things, like, it's gonna be, um, you know, like, yeah, it's just basically the final episodes for certain things, but, yeah, that's why this will be the final, you know, celebration or observance day, that we will actually cover so yeah um anyway let's just start international museum day okay um this article needs additional citations or citations for verification on may 2021 okay uh well there you go this is two years later uh, this banner is still here um okay International Museum Day or IMD is an international day held annually on or around uh, 18th of May. Oh, it's not exactly today, but it's around 18th of May. Interesting. Uh, but obviously, I will pick this one. will be out on May 18th. Because um, I think when I looked up, um, it's supposed to be May 18th. Uh, so yeah. Uh, coordinated by the International Council of Museums or ICOM. Uh, I-C-O-M. I think I'm going to call that ICOM. Uh, the event highlights a specific theme which changes every year, reflecting a relevant theme or issue facing museums internationally. Um, okay, let's let's pause a moment. When was the last time you visit museum? Uh, yeah, just any museum. Me though, uh, it's tough actually. When was the last time I went to museum? I think I remember somewhat, but I mean, um. It was kind of, you know, like frequently, uh, you know, we did a museum tour, but I don't know, like, which one was the most recent one, though. That is interesting. Um, uh, it's tough, actually. Uh, let's see here. Can I, like, remember something? Um, maybe. I do remember in 2015, I think. Is it 2015 or 2016? Huh. Interesting. Um. Wait. Uh. Huh. It might be in 2016. Actually, now that I think about it, is it 2016 or 2015? Uh. Huh. When was that? So it was about museum about um education. I think. Uh. You know, general education. Um for students uh for you know like uh what is it like uh elementary uh, elementary you know students so yeah it's it's museum for that so there is lots of you know like uh, toys physics toys and stuff like that i think it might actually be recent uh okay uh, i remember though for sure it was in 2015 but let me remember if I actually visited, you know, something, uh, some places after that, you know, like uh, 2015 is like eight years ago, right? So 
uh, let me remember if I visited, uh, you know, some other places, um, you know, like museum themed, uh, I don't think so, I might actually, but I forgot, oh, okay, okay, uh, oh wait, what, no, uh, I, I remember something from 2017, but it was not museum, I don't think, it's like art, um, I guess you can call it, uh, art museum, I guess, so it's about, you know, like, I don't know, it, it's kind of look like museum for arts, but it's it's it only happened for a period of time after that you know after that it's over the museum is no longer there so i don't know if you can call that museum or not it's more like art festival i think it's like showcase yeah like art showcase uh but can you call that museum i have no idea because again it was only for a period of time i remember that in 2017 um I remember, you know, being there with my best friend, uh, you know, one of my best friend actually, well, I mean, I don't know, uh, since 2020, I never heard about him anymore, so yeah, it's been three years actually, more than three years since uh, the last time I heard about him, so yeah, I don't know, um, I guess, can you call that still a best friend, I don't know, or just acquaintance at the moment, I have no idea, but yeah, anyway, um let's continue uh imt provides the opportunity for museum professionals to meet the public and alert them as to the challenges that museums face and raise public awareness uh, on the role museums play in the development of society it also promotes dialogue between museum professionals okay um i mean is there really any issue issue i mean with museums uh, I feel like there's nothing, but yeah, I don't know, like, uh, uh, like, do people not go to museums anymore? I have no idea. Uh, maybe it, it, it was, you know, during the pandemic, maybe, you know, like, uh, no one's going out, so no one's really going to museum, and yeah, I guess, uh, that makes sense, right? But, uh, you like... It's 2023 now. Uh, I think the pandemic uh, is kind of slowing down. I mean, it's still there, but, you know, it's it's no longer restricting people to uh, go outside. So, you know, like, uh, it's, um, it's probably a thing now, right? Like, just to go to a museum. But, yeah, I have no idea because this article was probably created, like, a while ago. Like, this one, uh, this mentioned may 2021 right obviously that was two years ago so maybe things change now maybe that is no longer the issue i have no idea but yeah we'll see uh what is this people visiting the pushkin fine arts museum on international museum day i have no idea what that is uh this kind of looks like it's placed in um uh, U.S. It kind of looks like North Dakota or South Dakota. Uh, <laughs> that was a little bit specific of me mentioning that. Uh, the reason why is because I remember uh, Mount Rushmore and the the location of the Mount Rushmore is kind of similar to this. You know, with with the big trees like this. I think it's kind of the same tree. I have no idea. Maybe it's just generic tree. I have no idea. Um, so yeah, maybe not be there, I have no idea, but yeah. Uh, Pushkin Fine Arts Museum. Uh, uh, do I want to visit there? Let's just go, actually. Uh, let's just go, where is it? Where is this location? Oh, it's in Russia. Okay, I was wrong. I, I, I was dead wrong. Okay, <laughs> let's go back then. Uh, it's not in US, it's actually in Russia. Okay, um, yeah. Um, anyway, let's continue. Uh, history. First International Museum Day took place in 1977, so that is 23 plus 23, okay, uh, that is interesting, 23 years ago is 2000, 23 years before 2000 is 77, so yeah, that is 46 years ago, interesting, um, kind of the same length to, to you know, to, to reach 2000 uh, from 77 and also from 23, that is interesting. Um, Okay, I come. Okay, uh, okay. Mm, let's see here. 
Each year, museums internationally are invited to par- participate in IMD to, pom- to promote the role of museums around in the world. Okay. Um, okay, so it's uh, it's like a campaign, pretty much, just to draw uh, visitors to visit uh, museums in general, I guess. Uh, okay. Themes. Oh, we, th- we have themes. Okay, that is interesting. Uh, let's see from... 92 okay museums and environment museums and indigenous people behind the scenes in museums response and responsibility collecting today for tomorrow the fight against illicit traffic of cultural property pleasures of discovery museums for peace and harmony in society uh, museums building community museums and globalization uh, museums and friends museums and intangible heritage okay Uh, museums preaching cultures museums and young people okay i find some pattern here since 2000s uh it's all started with the word museums interesting um and universal heritage as agents of social change and development and tourism for social harmony and memory objects tell your story okay uh in a changing world new challenges new inspirations okay that is long um museums memory plus creativity equals social change okay uh collections make connections for a sustainable society and cultural landscapes and contested history saying the unspeakable in museums okay that is the longer one so far uh hyper connected museum okay so this is the <laughs> uh, after 18 years they finally not use the word museum as the first word Uh, for the theme, interesting. New approaches, new publics, okay. As cultural hubs, the future of tradition, museum for equality, diversity, and inclusion, okay. Uh, the future of museums, recover and reimagine, and then the power of museums. And obviously, today, uh, 2023, I recorded this one a bit a while ago. So I don't know what the theme for current year is for 2023. Uh, it might actually haven't been decided just yet. Actually, not that I think about it. So yeah, that's why it's not here because I was a little bit too early to make this video. This was created um, two and a half months ago, actually. So yeah, this was in the last week of February. Uh, this one will be in the middle of February, so yeah, it, it, I, in fact, it's actually almost uh, three months by now, so yeah. Um, there's that timeline, okay, so 2007, I guess it's just, yeah, it's just every year, I guess, like what happened every year, which is interesting, okay. Um, yeah, let's just skip this through, maybe I will read the 2020s, probably, I don't know. Let's see here, 2020, okay. Due to the pandemic, IMD 2020 under the theme uh, diversity and inclusion was primarily marked with virtual events. Yeah, just like any other events, um, you know, because everything is on lockdown. So yeah, uh, theme focused on impact of the pandemic on museums. And yeah, obviously, right? Uh, I think I already mentioned about this earlier. Um, basically, since everyone's at home, everyone's doing everything online. It means that no one's really going to the museum. Uh, so, yeah. Uh, I think, though, uh, in 2020, I believe I remember um, a news about uh, going to museums virtually, I think, uh, online. I think it, it was actually a thing, right? I forgot where it was, but there was actually a museum where there is, like, robot. Uh, with the camera and people just you know watch around the museum uh, through the robot with the camera so yeah anyone i don't know if it was paid or not it probably was actually uh yeah i have no idea maybe it was free as well i have no idea uh but yeah but uh, basically people went to museum online through the yeah through the recordings not recordings actually it's probably a live footage as well so Yeah, uh, that's pretty much it. But anyway, uh, that is it for the end of the page. Um, yeah, um, I guess that is all about International Museum Day. Uh, let me know when was the last time you went to a museum or the last time you visited 
museum like was it uh, this year was it last year uh, obviously it's not 2020 2021 so yeah it's probably this year and last year so yeah let me know where you went uh, or where you visited during those times or even again like the last time you know like uh, probably even you know in 2015 for example i have no idea maybe it's part of you know study tour probably i don't know with your school going to the museum you know that's possible right i mean that's like a common thing uh you know like uh, it's common activity done uh, internationally i feel like um i feel like every school at one point you know like having a tour or trip with the students to museums i feel like you know that's uh, that's normal thing so yeah uh but let me know if that is that was actually your uh last one your 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 last visit to the museum but yeah anyway i think i'll be for this one um i hope you guys enjoy it uh this is the final um commemoration or celebration day that we will discuss after this there will be no more about this and yeah but anyway I think that'll be for this one. I hope you guys enjoy it. Stay safe, healthy. I will see you again tomorrow with another discussion. Obviously, um, we will have 12 days left after this one. And yeah, tomorrow, uh, 11 days left. The next day after tomorrow, uh, 10 days left, etc, etc. And yeah, like in two weeks, really, this everything, you know, uh, there is there will be no more discussions. But yeah, um, anyway... Uh, again, thank you guys for watching. Stay so I will see you again very soon. But until then, see ya.